What a magnamazing Sunday morning it is. Today is 12-3-2023. And as I was doing my evening devotion, what came to me was the names of Jesus. John 6, 26 through 27 says, Jesus replied, I tell you the truth. You want to be with me because I fed you, not because you understood the miraculous signs. But don't be so concerned about perishable things like food. Spend your energy seeking the eternal life that the Son of Man can give you. For God the Father has given me the seal of his approval. When Jesus walked the earth with his disciples, he denounced those who sought him solely based on the benefits he could offer because he is the Son of Man. The names of Jesus. John 6, 32 through 35 says, Jesus said, I tell you the truth. Moses didn't give you bread from heaven. My father did. And now he offers you the true bread from heaven. The true bread of God is one who comes down from heaven and gives life to the world. Sir, they said, give us that bread every day. Jesus replied, I am the bread of life. Whoever comes to me will never be hungry again. Whoever believes in me will never be thirsty. When we learn daily from the book of instruction, we welcome Jesus into our lives to satisfy our hungry souls because he is the bread of life. The names of Jesus. John 10, 7 through 8 says, Yes, I am the gate. Those who come in through me will be saved. They will come and go freely and will find good pastures. The thief's purpose is to steal and kill and destroy. My purpose is to give them a rich and satisfying life. It's best if you get to the gate. The names of Jesus. John 14, 6 through 7 says, Jesus told him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one can come to the Father except through me. If you had really known me, you would really know who my father is. From now on, you do know him and you have seen him. For all doubters, it does not get any clearer than this. Jesus told him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. The names of Jesus. John 15, 1 through 2 says, I am the the true grapevine, and my father is the gardener. He cuts off every branch of mine that doesn't produce fruit, and he prunes the branches that do bear fruit so they will produce even more. John 15, 5 through 8 says, Yes, I am the vine, you are the branches. Those who remain in me and I in them will produce much fruit, for apart from me you can do nothing. Anyone who does not remain in me is thrown away like a useless branch and withers. Such branches are gathered into a pile to be burned. But if you remain in me and my word remain in you, you may ask for anything you want and it will be granted. When you produce much fruit, you are my true disciples. This brings great glory to my father. I leave you with this. Come to Jesus right now. Today, salvation is your choice, and all you have to do is apply one of or all the names of Jesus to your life. Jesus wants us to seek him for our hungry spiritual souls and body, and not for influence or other selfish reasons. True believers follow our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, because they know he is the truth and the key to life's ultimate purpose and meaning. When we are spiritually hungry, we can have the bread of life by having the right sustainable and consistent relationship with Jesus. How many of you often find yourselves hungry after you had eaten within a short period of time? When you eat from the bread of life, you can eat as much as you want, as often as you want, and you do not have to worry about becoming obese or having other health concerns because of what you are eating. Jesus gave himself many names. Each name was significant during the time in which he used the name. Listen to this message again and read the word of God to understand when you need to call on one of the names of Jesus and apply it to your life. The grapevine is a useful 
useful for prolific plant that produces fruit to eat, raisins to store, and wine for meals and ceremonies. As we stay connected to the vine, we can live a very joyful and prosperous life. However, when we refuse to turn away from our sinful ways, God will cut us away from the vine, which is Jesus. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life, the gate to our salvation. He is our shelter that will never need repair or remodeling. He is our insurance policy that will never lapse. He is the creator of the world and everything in it. And in the end, he will be the judge, jury, and the executioner. God left our ticket at will call, and we have the choice to pick them up individually. You will not be able to send your children, your siblings, or any other family member or your friend to get the ticket for you. If you seek admittance to God's kingdom and want to claim your spot in heaven, choose Jesus over things of this earth. Thank you, God, for providing us a sure way to get to you. The names of Jesus. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Have a magnum amazing day. Be legendary. And our purpose is your blessing.